everybody. Welcome back to Kilo Sports Cards Box Breaks. I have another unboxing for you tonight, and it's, um, it's actually two from um, Jap's family. Um, I had a couple of them stack up because we just actually moved from Colorado to Virginia, so I have not been on for a while because of that. We've been getting settled in and uh, starting to get some of my other mail forwarded and stuff, and trying to remember to get my address changed on everything else and um had some hiccups along the way with moving and stuff like that so uh this would be my first time i've actually done a video since we've moved in so um i don't have my usual setup so it's kind of it's a little bit wonky right now until i get um the rest of my stuff unpacked but uh bear with me and i can at least uh get some packs open here so this is going to be October and November's. Uh, this is the $26 uh, donation pack that I do. Jabs usually has um, quite a few different tiers that he does where you can get um, a certain amount of packs sent to you. Um, you can also join it as breaks if you're a Patreon. Um, his breaks are kind of hard to join though sometimes because he does uh, like a lot of cases at a time and um, basically you have to buy a whole, uh, like a whole box typically is how his breaks work. So I don't get into his a whole lot, but I like to watch them because I do like watching the, all the, uh, cases that he opens of the same product. It's cool to see all the case hits and everything. Okay. So we have, we're just going to combine them. And I do have October and November here. If I can get it open without cutting the, cutting the pack open. So I'm pretty excited to open some cards. I haven't been able to open any for a while. I mean, I've opened like a blaster here and there, prestige but off camera, but nothing uh, too exciting, so. So I don't care if I get absolutely nothing in these. I am just excited to open packs. So, all right, let's see what we got. So we have a couple Allen Ginter. Uh, these are 2021 Allen and Ginter. That one's a little thick. Might have something in that one. I don't know. It kind of feels a little bit thick. These are, oh, that's why, because that's a hobby and this is a retail. All right, so we got Allen and Ginter. We got a 2021 Heritage Minor League. Uh, we have a couple of, let's see, we got a 2021 update and a 2021 Series 2. Those are both hobby. So we'll do the update before the Series 2. And then he usually sends a couple of vintage packs. So we got, well, different it looks like. All right, so we got a 1990 uh, Bowman. We got a 89 Tops, a Fleer 1990, a Donruss, what is this year? 88, I think. 88 Donruss. Put that there, and then a 91 Fleer. So we'll do it this way. Oh, and then a 92 Fleer Ultra Series 2. Alright, so I usually open the older packs first anyway. Okay, then we got a 2021 Chrome. So I'll put that after. And then another Series 2. And then we got a 2021 Pro Debut. Okay, so we'll do it like this. There we go, kind of just like that. And uh, here we go. So we'll start with the 89, is that what I said? 88 Donruss. Now I'm not really well versed in my older vintage kind of stuff, so I'm not sure which rookies and stuff we're looking for in here. So I guess on these older ones, we'll find out when we pull something if we get anything good. All right, so we got Mike, Mike Henneman, Bill Schroeder, Mark Williamson, Tommy John, a checklist, Kurt Ford, 
Brian Dayett, Brian Fisher, Damaso Garcia, Nick Isaki, or Saski, Greg Gross, Shane Mack, Dave Smith, Jim Wynn, and Kurt Manwaring rated rookie. All right, if you see something that I missed that's a uh, awesome card or a rookie that I didn't recognize because I don't know all these. Sometimes it's hard for me to tell if they're rookies or not unless it actually says rookie on there. Just because I'm not, I don't know a lot of the older stuff. So um, if you see that I missed one, please let me know in the comments. It's just an advertisement. <laughs> All right, so we have George Brett. It's a pretty cool one. I don't even have my stands unpacked, so I can't even. I'll just stand them up against the boxes, I guess, if I get something. Um, Ron Guidry, Julio Franco, Mark Davidson, Jimmy Key, Steve Searcy, Roberto Alomar, Jesse Orozco. Gary Ward, Jerry Don Glayton, Terry Kennedy, Tom Foley, Dave Magadan, Lloyd Mos Mosby, and Tony Gwynn. That's a nice Tony Gwynn. Go ahead and set that one up just because it's cool. All right, then we got 1990 Bowman. And I will not eat the gum. Shout out to uh, Silver Sport. He uh, has eaten quite a few pieces of gum. If you want to check him out, you might be able to see him uh, take a bite out of some. Okay, we got a Kevin Romine, Bob Boone, Vaughn Hayes, Chuck Finley, Frank Tanana. Jesse Barfield, Kevin McReynolds, and this is one of those picture, picture card advertisement kind of things. I still put, keep those like in an album. Oh, we got Kirby Puckett. Yeah, see, like his, I'm not sure what year. I don't think that's an, an earlier year, but for him. Uh, we have Scott Sanderson. Juan Gonzalez, Mark Davis, Billy Spires, Mel Hall, and Scott Ruskin. See, like these, I have no idea if they're rookies or not. And this, oh, I guess, so, so like it says right there, 86. That's the only way I know if they're rookies or not in these older years. All right, we got a 1990 Fleer. These are always facing weird ways. Okay, we got just an action sticker thing. Keith Hernandez, Mark Williamson, Pete Smith, Greg Cataret, Don Carmen, Ruben Sierra, Lonnie Smith, Steve Searcy, Oral. Hersh Hershiser, Dave Schmidt, Kevin Bass, Terry Steinbeck, Greg Walker, Scott Sh Scooter, Scudder, and Damaso Garcia. Alright, so I don't think we've got anything too amazing yet. Alright, uh, Fleer, 91. So it's taken me a while to upload these videos, too, because I didn't realize that where we moved to, it's kind of up in the mountains. So apparently it's hard to get internet up here. So uh, hopefully I'm going to be able to do some breaks, because if not, I might be uh, renting the library or something for to try to do some breaks. Because uh, I just assume that everybody has internet nowadays in 2021. I did not even think to research it out here. 
but it is really difficult to get uh, good internet out here. Still working on trying to get something to work a little bit faster than what it is, so at least we have something now. Okay, so there's a logo sticker for the Astros. If you all have any ideas, you live in a rural area, please let me know if you have uh, ways to rig stuff up. Um, I'm trying extenders and um, whatever I can to, aside from Lincoln routers together, just because I don't know how to do that yet, but I will learn if I need to. All right, we got Dwight Smith, Ozzy Smith. It's a pretty cool one. Uh, Carlos Garcia, Ray Lankford, John Cerruti, Juan Samuel, Dennis Rasmussen, Tom O'Malley, Scott Bankhead, Damon Berryhill, Brett Butler, Mariano Duncan, feels like there's two cards sometimes, Lynn Dixtra, Ken Ob Obergfell, and Dennis Martinez. All right. Okay, 92 Fleer Ultra, Series 2. Yeah, definitely my lighting is not great here right now. Definitely need to fix some things. Okay, we got Paul Miller. Esteban Beltre, rookie. Oh, that's a Paul Miller rookie, too. Um, ben Rivera, rookie. Rafael Ramirez. Dave Hansen. Barry Jones. Bob Tewksbury. Lance Blankenship. Rico Rossi. Rich Rodriguez, Dave Burba, Tim Nering, and Jar oh, Jarvis Brown, and then there's one more, Todd Froworth. All right, so that is it for the vintage stuff. I don't think we got anything too amazing out of that. Except for the Tony Gwynn's pretty cool. All right, uh, 2021 Heritage Minor League. Josiah Gray, Glen Allen Hill Jr., Dylan Dingler, it's a pretty good one, Avery Short, oh, we got a mini of Bobby Witt Jr., cool, I don't know how hard it is to get the minis, but that's pretty cool, uh, Cody Ho Hoisey, I don't think I've ever gotten a mini out of these, so I don't think it's too easy to get them. That feels so thick. Oh, that one feels like a lot. No, I guess not. I don't know. I guess I'm losing it. Uh, Francisco Alvarez and David Calabrese. Alright, so pretty cool Bobby Witt. Uh, Alan and Ginter uh, re Retail. I guess this is... I don't know if this is from a blaster box. I can't really say. I know it's not. I know it's not hobby, but I'm not sure what, what it comes out of. So, okay, we got Freddie Freeman, Sano. Oh, I forgot to check the backs of these. Uh, let's see if we got anything short printed. Nope. Base pack. All right, so we got Freeman, Sano, Darvish, uh, Springer Mini. It's a regular back. Uh, we got Birds of a Feather, Blue and Gold Macaw. No, there's some of these that are supposed to be kind of rare too. I'm just not sure which ones they are. That's just a insert. Okay, and then we have. Um, JD Martinez. So, I don't 
think there's variations or anything in there. All right, the hobby pack of Ellen and Ginter. Okay, we got Marquez, Snyder, Hayes, Brett, Henderson, that's a cool one, DeGrom, uh, Mini of Seeger, Corey Seeger, and that's an Alan Ginter back. And then we have another blue and gold macaw. It's funny to get the same um, birds of a feather out of there. I guess it's not rare. <laughs> that one's not anyway. All right, we have 2021 Pro Debut. Okay, we got Matt Manning. Freudus Nova. Cole Franklin. Oh, we got a short print or something. Oh, and an auto. Michael Bush. Cool. So, our first auto, Michael Bush. Kind of sounds familiar. I think I've heard of him before. So, uh, Jose Rodriguez, Bobby Witt Jr., Cody Hoisey, and Grant McCray. So, not a bad pack. Another Bobby Witt and a auto. All right, so 2021 update. That's a hobby. All right, we have Alec Bohm right off the bat. Nice. Let's get those over and put him up. Uh, Joe Kelly. Casey Mize, another good one. Adrian Heuser. Um, Christian Pache, rookie debut. Frankie Montez. Pat Voleka. Josh Bell. Freddie Freeman. Oh, we got a Juan Soto uh, black gold. That's cool. I like those black golds. I'm running out of room already to put inserts up. I need my stands. Um, Ashton Goudeau, rookie. Josh Grant. Rookie debut, Shane McClanahan. And Josh Palacios. Rookie. All right, so not a bad pack. Cool one, Soto. And let me just check. Oh, I could check for short prints later. I'll just put those all in the pile. Rookies. Okay. Uh, 2021 Series 2. And that's a hobby. Yep. It's a hobby. I don't know if the top of the phone is, but. Got Didi Gregorius, Mike Soroka, Zach Eflin, Christian Arroyo, Tony Watson, Nathan Eovaldi, Brennan Belt, German Marquez, Taewon Walker, and we have a gold of Anthony Rendon, not a rookie, but still nice to get a gold. Uh, we have a New York Mets team card, championship fireworks for the Dodgers, uh, Brennan Rogers, and a rookie of Alejandro Kirk. So I think that's our only rookie we got besides the, uh, yeah, only rookie. Um, series two, and twenty one, and then we'll be down to one pack. All right, we got Ryan Presley, Jared Dyson, David Price, Edwin Rios, Kiston Hira. Corey Dickerson, Jazz, nice. Put that. I'll put that there, I guess. Jazz. 
uh, Corbin Burns, uh, rookie of Luis Alexander Basabe, um, Alex Avila, Tim LaCastro, Giants team card, Phillies team card, and Cubs team card. All right. So not too bad. All right, last pack, 2021 Topps Chrome. And this is out of, I'm not sure what that stands for. It's definitely not hobby, so it's probably out of a blaster. All right, we have Alex Kuriloff. That's a nice rookie to get. And then we have a prism coming up. Um, Tony Gonsolin with the Rookie Cup. Braylon Marquez. And our prism is going to be Tanaka. Mashiro Tanaka. All right, so not too bad. A little recap of what we got. We got an Alex Kuriloff, Topps Chrome rookie. We got a Jazz rookie. We got a... Anthony Rendon, uh, gold. Bobby Witt Jr. mini from my Heritage Minor, and that's a. So I'm not sure what the difference is. If there's differences in these backs, I'm not sure how rare that one is, but it's pretty cool. Um, we got a Juan Soto black gold. That's a pretty cool insert. And an Alec Bohm rookie. Tony Gwynn, just a cool card, and an auto of Michael Bush from Miners. All right, so that is it for the Jabs Family Patreon packages. Um, thanks for watching, and hopefully I can get my setup back to where it needs to be or a little bit uh, better than what I had it because I'm in a totally new place now, so... Um, it's going to take a little work and, uh, hopefully I can get some better internet so I can do some breaks. So, uh, watch for some breaks coming up, hopefully, and I will see you on the next one. Thanks. Bye.